It was dramatic, loud, and flashy. No, not Lady Gaga at the Oscars, but El Nino. Hello, I am Austin Cole for Collegian Wire, and this is Vox Pop, voice of the students. This morning on March 7th, El Nino made its long-awaited arrival as it came stomping in in the early morning hours. In this week's edition of Vox Pop, find out how LACC students welcomed in the long-awaited Godzilla storm. I went to sleep, it was, everything was fine, it was cool. When I woke up, it was rain everywhere. I'm like, yeah. So, you know, so I, I liked it a lot. It startled me, and I was contemplating not coming to school, but luckily for me, by the time I was, you know, headed to class, it had stopped raining. And we needed it, so I didn't feel too bad. I was actually kind of happy that we got the rain. Well, uh, in my location, I couldn't, I didn't actually hear any ram rumbling or thunder or anything. But if it was in my location, I would, I would just be really excited, be amazed. I would just go outside, dance in the rain, take pictures, because, you know, it's something that doesn't happen every day. I'm a hard sleeper. El Nino is just a good storm. <laughs> so. Well, I was just waking up, so I was like, okay, what's going on? But then, I thought it was just like a normal rainy day, but then I don't know where when, like the thunder, the lightning started happening, I was like, whoa, okay, it was just, it was a little. This was only the first installment of El Nino storms this month. We will keep you updated as more fronts continue to approach Los Angeles. For Collegian Wired, this is Austin Cole reporting.